Hi pool fans, welcome back. In today's episode, I'm going to help you guys bank the ball a little bit better. I'm going to help you amateurs understand the art of banking and what happens when you hit it too hard or with a bit of spin. We're not going to cover long banks and difficult banks. This is about easy bank shots just to help you guys. Okay, so what we're going to do today is we're not going to cover the kind of difficult banks. So we're not going to look at long banks and we're not even going to cover bank shots from sort of this direction into the side. Because this is, it's for lower end players who probably don't understand how the balls react and how the rails react and even putting unwanted side spin on the cue ball. So that is the plan today. So let me just get rid of this ball. And whether you've got a table at home or you go to a club or wherever you play pool, just put the cue ball here and we're going to use this centre diamond and this end diamond at the beginning. And I just want you to put your shaft over this middle diamond and aim to hit this diamond, just like so. And try not to put any side spin on. Um, so just at a nice pace. No side spin and the cue ball will scratch. Now, if we just pop that back where it was, and if we do the same again, but we do put a bit of right hand English on, the cue ball is going to go low, just like so. And again, whoops. And we put a bit of left hand English on or side spin, wherever you're from. It's going to come high. So that just covers just a little thing for you guys to understand uh, that we need to hit center of the cue ball to make this bank shot at a medium pace. Now, my cloth is pretty new still, so it's got a little bit of slide on it. If you're tight and you don't like spending your money and your cloth's been on it for about four years, it's going to bank a little bit shorter. So again, put the cue ball there and just work on this shot with the cue ball for now. Now, if we put a ball on this line, and it's the same philosophy, if we just play this cue ball along this line, centre of the ball, we're not whacking this 100 mile an hour, just nice and easy. We bank the ball. Didn't get that as clean as I could have, but you can see the idea. And then same again on the line, centre of the cue ball, but hit this one hard and it'll go short, just like the cue ball did. Now, again, we're using this line. Play this shot with left hand English and you'll see the three ball go a little bit wider there, you could see it. Still nearly banked it, but you can see it going lower because the side spin is shifting over to the object ball. Now if we play this with right and English, you can see it squaring up. So again, this is an easy bank shot, we know that, but it's so you can understand what is going on with the balls. So again, if we hit this hard, it's always going to squeeze and go low. Again, just nice medium pace. Make sure you hit the cue ball straight. And you should always bank the ball. Now, I'm going to set up another scenario on the table just to explain what to look for if you need to hit the bank shot hard. Let's have a look. So remember to watch where you're hitting on the cue ball, remember how hard you're hitting it and just look for your lines. This is a very simple basic kind of like a bank, not a drill but just to help the amateur understand about the rails, the cue ball and the spin. There's loads more to this as we move on down the line with the channel and, and of course you've got to be able to cue straight, that, that, that obviously helps. I've set a little scenario up here where you're just going to get a little bit more understanding on um, 
where you have to aim on the ball because you've got to hit it a little bit harder. So we've set this situation up and the nine ball's just somewhere up here. And again, middle diamond to this diamond, we know just at a nice pace, we're always gonna make the bank or scratch if we hit the ball good. If we play this bank shot now on them diamonds, so on that line, and we hit it hard, we know it comes short. We know that every time it will always do that. Now we need to hit this hard to get the cue ball up table to get a shot on the nine ball. So we know we can't hit this diamond because we've got to hit it a bit harder. So we've got to aim just off. Bear in mind how new your cloth is or how old, how old it is and just practice this shot. The more you keep doing it, you'll, you'll figure it out yourself. I'm here to just try and help you guys. This isn't like, um, like I'm trying to show off or anything like that. This is all about helping the amateur understand this game. So in this situation, just work on aiming just a little bit lower, probably like half a ball lower than the diamond. And obviously we've got to hit it a bit harder, as we've said. And there you see it goes in, it squeezes off the rail, comes into the bank, and we've got a shot on the nine. If we'd have played that same shot and we didn't hit it hard, the eight ball would come a little bit lower. So thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe. I hope this easy bank little routine setup is going to help you bad players bank the ball better. Don't bank her like a...